Okay then, let's finish this. Thank Got you. three more thugs to deal with. Okay, you have the gun, come here, and then go towards the ceiling while I deal with this guy. Hey guys, are you here for the two for one on European Masters too? Oh, wrong guy. You, come back here. There, all dealt with. This may not be art, but I like it. Who? He got nice moves. Four dork and tights. Are these yours? <sighs> Please. Wait! I think we can all agree, that's a very nice character model for Black Cat. Okay, so this is just the following mission, and yeah, she's incredibly jumpy. She can make jumps that we can't. So to explain why that is, I'm gonna say that it's kind of like um, the animated series mixed with the comics. So. She was highly trained, became a great athlete, a great cat burglar, and then... So, skin-tight leather. Doesn't that kind of chafe? You'll never find out, that's for sure. And then, uh, thanks to Wilson Fisk, she got both actual bad luck powers, rather than just preparing things to go wrong before a heist, actual bad luck powers, and a super soldier serum. So that would explain why she's able to do things that just absolute defy humanity. No normal human can do this, no matter how much they train, jeez. Although we're still faster than her. Easy to keep up. helping some old lady across the street or something? Nah, I already got that merit badge. Oh, okay, she's gone that way. Oh, I remember this part, so let's land here and she should run through us. Yeah, there we go. Just run completely through us. Huh. Come on, cat, where are you running off to? I mean, I did just catch you in a... Shouldn't you be helping some old lady across the street or something? Nah. I already got that merit badge. Come on, Kat, you've already said that. Yeah, we just caught her in an art gallery that was getting robbed. We've kind of got some questions for her. And let's just admire her character model. You always chase girls who brush you off? No, only the naughty ones. I have standards, after all. Standard is the word. And here I was expecting... amazing. Hey! Yep. Got away with the lady, Spidey. Mr. Smooth. Ah, uh, don't worry, Spidey. Was with that girl. Who was she? If she doesn't like you. This chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. Oh yeah, yeah, don't worry. I'll go check out the store. It's fine. Yeah, don't worry, Spidey. If she doesn't like you for who you are, just forget about her. She's not good enough for you. That girl was pretty incredible. Too bad she's probably a crook. And, yeah, if I was the type, the thumbnail I would use for this episode would just be an enormous shot of her cleavage. But luckily, I'm not the type. Okay, let's buy some upgrades very quickly. So, air jump, that'll do. Cannonball kick, that'll do. Multi-web tie, and... We'll leave the air tricks, they don't actually do anything, it's just for show. We want to save our points for things that are useful to us. And help out in fights. Okay. So now, we got to take some more photos of Spider-Man. I think. Either way, we're going into the Daily Bugle. Oop, don't crawl our way in, that'll be a bit conspicuous. Hey Betty, how are you? Hi Keith, 
pictures for the boss? Actually, I'm hoping he might have an assignment for me. Well, he's in a pretty good mood today. Maybe you'll get lucky. Go ahead in. Finally, someone who hasn't been bamboozled by that media-grabbing glory seeker, Spider-Man. This Quentin Beck's a special effects guy from Hollywood. Says he's got Spider-Man all figured out. Sounds like a media-grabbing glory seeker to me. Oh, Parker. I don't pay you for your opinion, Parker. I pay you for photos. Well, I... Let me guess. You don't have any pictures, do you? Uh... You're fired. Come back when you get me shots of that red and blue wacko. Ah, J.K. Simmons should have done this role. I think that's the third time J.J.'s fired me this week. Peter. Everything going okay? Hey, Robbie. Jonah beating you up again. <laughs> Don't mind him. Listen, I have a job you could do for me. We need a picture for a story. I want a high shot of the whole city. Here, if you have a map handy, I'll mark where I'd like you to take the picture. Can you get it for me? Sure thing, Robbie. I'll be back before you know it. Thanks. Yeah, J.K. Simmons. Absolutely perfect for the Spider-Man trilogy to play J. Jonah Jameson. I hope I'm, I'm thinking of the right actor. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Wait until you see what Robbie's got in store for us. He blatantly knows we're Spider-Man. No normal photographer could get these sorts of shots. He just flat out knows who we are. Okay, so let's keep on working our way up the Empire State Building. Okay, and then let's work our way further and further up, all the way to the top. Not quite yet though, just here. I, oh no, a little bit further down. Okay, so drop. Nicely done. Seriously, the other ones, I mean, they might be a bit reasonable. I could at least take an elevator up and take a photo out the window. We are now just on top of the Empire State Building. I mean, look at this. So we've taken these absolutely impossible shots. No one else could have taken them. And now, after about one minute of getting those amazing shots, we are now going back to the bugle and he's gonna pretend like it was all normal. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You just went to the top of the Empire State Building, took a bunch of photos that no one else could have taken. It took you about a minute. Yeah, nothing strange is going on here. It's all perfectly normal. Oh, this is great, Peter. I knew I could count on you. Take these photos to Jonah, and if you're ever having any trouble getting work from him, you come talk to me. You never know what I might have for you. Thanks, Robbie. I will. Hi, Pete. How are you doing today? Hi, Betty. I'm okay. Is Mr. Jameson around? Sure. Go on in. Ask how she is. Jeez. What do you want, Parker? Robbie said... Give me those. What is this garbage? Why are you bringing me shots of the city and not shots of Spider-Man? This is the sorriest excuse for... Oh, wait a second. Robbie wanted these, didn't he? Yeah, they're fine. Now get out of my office. Ah, it's nice to be appreciated for your hard work. Check it out. Let's get out of here. Rhino, get that equipment back to base, understood? Spider-Man, huh? Finally, I've been dying to see what you can do. Let's go. Ah, just try to break through my armor. I'm gonna break your bones and make you cry for your mama. 
I know. I'm going to take a wild guess that you're strong but dumb. Okay. Oh, don't worry, I know what that means. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's run away a bit while I try and talk. Yeah, so this is our first interaction with our new supervillain, Rhino. Let's do this. Come on. Oh man, I can't believe he went so close to do a charging attack. I heard you were so great, but you're just a king of stupid costume. There we go. So we just gotta get a nice accurate hit in and make him a bit dizzy. And not get hit straight after like that. We're doing a bit bad at the moment, but. Well, I've been hurting you a little bit so far. Like this. Okay. There we go. Okay, come on then, buddy. Yeah, we can't damage him otherwise. We've got to target his face specifically. Get him nice and dizzy before we attack him. And he is done. And we can just keep on attacking them if we choose. Come on. There we go. Okay, let's get our health back. And what else do we have to do? Okay, we just need to earn hero points. So, let's do a quick mission and hopefully... Nope. No bad guys in this hideout. Well, okay then. Let's search somewhere else. Get so we're just. If you only knew. So we're just gonna have to be on the lookout for a few more missions, and then we'll be able to continue the storyline. Oh, there's one. Okay, buddy, what do you need? You rang. Look out! That person's gonna fall. Okay, yeah, he's in a bit of a precarious situation. We can help with that. I'm slipping! I've got you. Don't worry. See? Nothing to it. You rescue me. And now we've got full health again. You're welcome, buddy. I got trapped in a car for a second, but that's fine. Come on, who else needs Spider-Man's help? I've, I've said it before, but I'll say it again. I love web-slinging in this game. And just as I say that, I go into a super slow running on the floor part. Great. Okay, that makes up for it, I think. Okay. Another mission. Spidey! Yo, what's up? I wonder what's on TV right now. I just saw someone get his car stolen at gunpoint. They went that way. Won't someone help? I'm being robbed. Don't worry, I'm on it. Okay, let's stop this car. Hey, hello. I'm gonna have to apologize to the owner because I am destroying their car in the process. Oh, oh no. The worst crime ever. A child has lost their balloon. Take good night, Gracie. Okay, we've got no time for these people. We've got to rescue a child's balloon. Got it. Here you go, kid. Try to hang on to it, Thank you. 
You're welcome. Okay, let's have our meeting with Dr. Otto Octavius, like Harry promised. Let's see how it goes. Harry! It's about time you got here. I was a busy man. I don't want to keep him waiting. Sorry, Harry. Never mind, let's go. Let me introduce my good friend, Peter Parker. It's a huge honor to meet Parker. Hmm. My friend Dr. Connors told me about a brilliant student of his named Parker, who can't seem to stay awake in class. <laughs> I'm sure Kurt has beaten him up enough already, Otto. You're right, of course. This is my wife, Rosie, without whom I would be lost. She is my assistant and inspiration. Come and take a look at my masterpiece. There it is. Sustained fusion has never been possible before. Why? Once the reaction reaches a certain point, it becomes impossible to contain and control it. Exactly. Until now. Using tritium in the core. Provided exclusively by Oscorp. Yes, of course. As I was saying, tritium in the core lends the reaction more stability. And these arms are the key. Amazing. How do they work? Well, you see, Peter, we don't want to keep Otto from his work. Uh, in that case, Peter, won't you join us for dinner next time you visit? I'm sure Otto would be happy to explain more then. I would love to. Thanks. See you then. I can't believe I actually got to meet Dr. Otto Octavius. God damn it, Harry. Once in a lifetime meeting with an absolute genius and you just talk all over him and interrupt him and jeez. Oh great, an ambush. Yeah, he's probably just jealous that he likes us better than him. Uh Mr. Taxicab, why are you here? Yikes! Yikes! I'm gonna be the guy who can Spider-Man. Oh, okay, great, so there's some guys who can block my attacks. And that's all she wrote. And I think one of them just got run over. Let me help you out. There you go, you're off. Oh, not quite off the road. There, you're off the road. I helped. Okay, let's just save this one last person. Oh, no. Thieves. Okay, so join me next time where I'll so between now and then I'll get rid of, I'll get all those hero points so I won't have to just do that for ages. Yeah, until next time. Bye for now.